Hello everyone. Under normal circumstances, this would be graduation week at the University of Aberdeen for summer 2021. We'd all be wearing our gowns and caps and you'd walk across the stage for me to doff you on the head to mark the fact that this is your special day. You've achieved your degree and we'd all be celebrating your success. Of course, under the current circumstances, it's still not possible to have our graduation ceremonies in the normal way. But we all still have a right to celebrate what our students have achieved. In fact, your achievement under these extraordinary circumstances is especially praiseworthy. All our students have shown amazing resilience and perseverance, despite these difficulties, to achieve outstanding academic success. So today I'm delighted to congratulate you on that success. The whole university community is very proud of the academic qualification that you've gained. We're planning to celebrate your achievements in person when circumstances allow. So we hope to see you again with your friends and family in Aberdeen. Thank you for all the work you've done and all the contributions that you've made while you've been a student here with us at the university. A very big well done from all of us here. On behalf of all University of Aberdeen graduates around the world, a very warm welcome to you, the extraordinary class of 2021, to the global alumni family. I can only imagine how challenging it has been for you to finish your studies and graduate in the midst of a global pandemic. But I want you to know just how proud the Aberdeen alumni family is of you and how excited we are to see what you will go on to achieve. Now that you are a member of the alumni family, I encourage you to stay in touch with the university, take advantage of the benefits, the enormous benefits of being an Aberdeen alumni brings you. Make sure you are signed up to the email list, connected on social media, and get involved with any local group, uh, groups or chapters in your area. This is a lifelong network that will serve you well in the years to come. Finally, on behalf of all your fellow Aberdeen alumni, I want to say a huge congratulations. Well done. To complete your studies and graduate under such challenging circumstances is an incredible achievement, and you should be very proud indeed. I'm sure you will be celebrating with friends and family to the extent that you can, and rightly so. Congratulations, class of 2021. My name is David Smith and I'm Head of School of Education. I hope that you and your loved ones are well. I'm delighted to have this opportunity to welcome you to Summer Graduation 2021. For some of you, the world has changed since you commenced your studies at the University of Aberdeen. What an understatement. For others of you, COVID-19 has been a constant throughout your studies. In any case, here we are, you watching this video, possibly from the comfort of your home, and me here on campus. We join together to mark your graduation and to take this opportunity to reflect, to reflect individually and corporately with supporters and loved ones on all that you have achieved and achieved in spite of it all. You did it. Your graduation marks a huge personal achievement of which I hope you are rightfully proud. You join a long line of Aberdeen education graduates in all their wonderful kaleidoscopic diversity. I hope that you will be an ambassador for our school and our university, and that you will make a positive difference to the lives of others through the learning that you have gained. 
Your school of education and its tutors will be rooting for you and hoping that you continue to flourish. Thanks to you, your tutors, your programme leadership teams and the friends and supporters who celebrate your important achievement with you today. All the very best on behalf of the school. Hello, my name is Professor Graham Nixon. I work in the School of Education at the University of Aberdeen. And I've been given the great privilege and honour of giving a, a graduation address for you at this online celebration of your achievement. An achievement which has taken place in yeah, an unprecedented time of challenge, obstacle and distance. And despite the fact we can't meet at the ancient university campus at Aberdeen that you can see in my background here, um, I hope that this online celebration is a chance for you to sit amongst friends and family, perhaps with a drink, and take in the good. As some of you may know, I'm the programme director of our MSc programme, Studies in Mindfulness at the university. There's been unprecedented interest in that area, perhaps because of lockdown. Many academics in this field talk about how we can, we can through deliberate contemplation, change our mind, install certain qualities and dispositions, give ourselves a resource that can take us forward and be agile and resilient. The human mind is a, a tricky thing and many academics think that it is prone to what is called the negativity bias. That our evolutionary heritage has given us a, a threat system that's always on the lookout, always ready to be fearful, triggered, catastrophizing. And perhaps the conditions of modern life provide many opportunities for being triggered. Some academics think that this negativity bias means that the human mind is, is like Velcro for criticism, it sticks. And like Teflon for praise, it slides away and doesn't last. And maybe that's borne out in your own experiences. So what I want to do in this speech is give you the opportunity to, to reflect on your achievements with a sense of gratitude to install a sense of pride of achievement and yes gratitude for what we have achieved or what you have achieved so maybe reflect on all that you've done whether that's in your undergraduate honors degree designate degree your master's degree your phd your mth your mphil whatever achievement we're here to celebrate reflect on perhaps how you felt when you began. What did you expect? What were your aspirations? How did you feel? Reflect on those moments of small achievement, perhaps, in the early days or the challenges you overcame. Reflect on the moments of positive encounter with fellow students, with academics, with tutors, professors, lecturers, those moments of recognition, those moments of praise. Reflect on the highs of your degree. You've earned it. You've hard earned your achievements. And let's maybe talk about that a little bit, what that means. Hard earned knowledge, recognised uni university knowledge, gathered in a community of knowledge creation, not just in the University of Aberdeen, but a wider network and web of universities that sometimes is called the academy. A communal way in which the human race can light up its experience of the universe. Hard earned knowledge. Because a lot of the time in this, some would say, atomized, 
individualistic age that we live in, knowledge can seem easy. Mediated to us by social media, often giving us a kind of algorithmic pat on the back that kind of force feeds us back our own preferences and generates knowledge and opinions that often are far from humble. But what you've gained through this experience is hard earned knowledge at the academy, which belongs to a web, as I say, of institutions where academics have worked on a hunch, developed a theory based on observation, experimented in the world, explored an anomaly in human understanding, tested their hypothesis and generated a theory about how we go forward. Born in a, in a spirit of humility and a recognition that knowledge is often provisional and can change and evolve. Humble knowledge. So your degrees, as I say, whether MA, PhD, designate, MTH, MPhil, are part of this luminous process that takes place at university. So take in the good. Rick Hansen, an academic who works in the field of mindfulness uh, and neuroscientist, says that we can move from the red zone, the threat zone, to the green zone. It should be our default setting, a restful space, a place where we can be reassured, we can generate, as I say, resilience and agility. Not fearful, not threatened. So I want to leave you by saying, take in the good. Marinade in your experiences as you graduate. Move into the green zone. And I wish you all the best going forward in the next stage. Master of Science, Person-Centred Counselling, Priska Ekem Dillam Kuhl, Linda Facher, Maria Elena Laguarda Silvestra, Victoria McLeod Hay, Patricia Ann McRobbie, Caroline Helena Montagu, Sinead Margaret Shaw, Laura Jane Wiseman. Studies in Mindfulness, Betsy Bruce Anderson, Stephen Burke, Shirley Louise Gonsalves, David Harrison, Amanda Jane Hillis, Sandra Vivian Kirkwood, Marta Regina, Shirley Teresa Rose, Sandra Jane Rowlands, Master of Education, Christine Ann Aldred, Shakira Alessio, Early Years, May Janet Elizabeth Gray, Amy Jane McFarlane, Madeline Mackay, Francoise Peel, Sarah Helen Walker, Mary Ann Wallace, Megan Watson, Pastoral Care Guidance and Pupil Support, Lorna Baker, Neil Connell, Postgraduate Diplomas Education, Zoe Kirsten White. Education Early Years, Orietta Bell. Pastoral Care, Guidance and Pupil Support, Lindsay Blackadder, Avis Brenda Stephanie Parker. Person-Centred Counselling, Karen Lane Bremner, Tamsin Bonita Brett, Suzanne Alfreda Foreman, Lorraine Helen Glennie, Shona Mary Horsman, Malachi Smiley, Sally White. Psychological Wellbeing Counseling and Psychotherapy. Thomas William Grayson Morrison, Andrew Smart. Studies in Mindfulness. Mary Iliova, Dorota Renata Kidrowska. Karen Phillip. 
postgraduate certificates, autism and learning. Elish Ann Bremner. Lehan Briggs. Danielle Faye Brunigia. Saskia Dixon. Angela Jennifer Ferguson. Laura Lee Moncrief Lister. Kimberly McIntosh. Catherine Sabina Michi. Kira Smith. Education. Kelly Stewart. Layla Kuiper. Higher Education, Learning and Teaching. Rhoda Mary Wilkie. Inclusive Practice. Suzanne Horn. Alison Kimsey. Evgenia Kritiku. Alexandra Marie McEwen. Natalie Milne. Amai Jai Pearson. Sharon Elizabeth Reed. Angela Firth. Into Headship. Specialist Qualification for Headship. Craig McDermott. Leadership in Professional Contexts. Sarah Dakak. Middle Level Leadership and Management. Amanda Conn. Jed Alexander Gilchrist. Linda Louise Glass. Evelyn Rendell. Pastoral Care, Guidance and Pupil Support. Jennifer Humphreys. Michael John Tyrrell. Studies in Mindfulness. Janet Horrocks. Nicholas Hunt. Billy Jane Sim. Amy Stewart. Teaching Qualification. Further Education. Aurelian Andre Amalut, Rebecca Anderson, Mark Bonatti, Kathleen Bowe, Ray Louise Brown, Angela Helen McLean Carey, Lee Margaret Kisolo, Bruce Peter Benjamin Colley, Lindsay Marie Conker, Patricia Ann Krull, John Augustine Curry, Gordon Arthur Daniels, Jacqueline Duncan, Elizabeth Downowski, Dylan Thomas William Edmonds, Jade Lauren Fotheringham, Gary Graham, Jerry Gray, Laura Sophia Guyon, Sarah Ann Herzog, Larissa Jane Hinder, Kerry Hopkirk, Deborah Irvin, Gabrielle Jogalate, Peter Kelly, Joseph Anthony Lamara, Colin Cumming McAlpine, Patricia McClare, Alistair McIntosh, Peter Thomas Marshall, Jane Catherine Malhuish, Kirsty Ann Miller, Deirdre Ann Murphy, Maria Panzari, Olympia Papasotti, Stuart Pitt, Fiona Elizabeth Reed, Kirsty Margaret Redford, James Ritchie, Theria Roberts, Killian Rush, Catherine Mary Smythe, Callum George Swanson, Wendy Ann Third, Gary Waddell, Emma Louise Walker, Michael Wallace, David Martin Whitley, Sarah Wilson, Kirstine Wright, Heather Rona Yates. Master of Arts, Educational Studies. Rhiannon Elizabeth, Miriam Cleghorn, Rachel Ann Elder. Honours Degrees, Education. Georgia Abernethy, Lauren Rebecca Aitchison, Mary Catherine Alexander, Molly May Allen, Katie Joy Anderson, Chloe Louise Ockney, Joanna Anneli Backman, Lauren Jane Bell, Billy Bishop, Nicola Lauren Black, Shannon Elizabeth Brown, Emily Jill Buchan, Heather Ann Buchan, Chloe Erin Mackay Cameron, Rachel Cameron, Shannon Laura Campbell, Amy Castley, Paige Elise Seabrunt, Jennifer Hannah Coates, 
Francesca Coleman, Elizabeth Victoria Cowney, Amy Crawford, Olivia Crockett, Chloe Crooks, Victoria Cruikshank, Ellen Daisy Davidson, Morven Lynn Davidson, Lamy Duthie, Melissa Fairley, Robin Lisa Fluckett, Rebecca Frew, Leanne Kristen Fullerton, Rebecca Gold, Laura Margaret Graham, Rebecca Gray, Kathleen Marie Gunning, Isla Harkas, Alyssa Hannah Lowry Hassan, Rebecca Elizabeth Hay, Caitlin Harriet Hogg, Hannah Jameson, Brody Catherine Lawson, Yvonne Lindy, Morgan McAvoy, Erin Cameron McGregor, Hannah Mackay, Carrie Beth McLennan, Kaylee Isabel McLeod, Julia Mariniak, Terry Morrison, Caitlin Muldoon, Harry Charles Murphy, Hannah Much, Hannah Sarah Neville, Megan Chloe Peters, Bryden Priest, Sadika Rahman, Mariam Ramsey, Megan Alas Reed, Rachel Reed, Rebecca Reed, Flora Amy Robinson Ennis, Evelyn Deborah Ross, Caitlin Roster, Abby Megan Sanders, Ian Scott, Rachel Ellen Seaman, Rebecca Louise Shepherd, Samantha Shepherd, Charlotte Jane Smith, Ailey Elizabeth Stewart, Katie Margaret Stewart, Carly Stott, Abby Sutherland, Amy Margaret Thompson, Katie Thompson, Bethany Sarah Walker, Katie Wallace, Jenna Wallach, Sophie Leslie Ann Wardle, James Watson, Jessica Watson, Kirsten Kathleen Elizabeth Watson, Charlie Waugh, Christy Alexandra Whittle, Kaylee Rattray Wright, Kirsten Ulrika Mary Zinner. Bachelor of Arts Childhood Practice, Paula Anderson, Sarah Barkley, Lorna Cobb, Carly Pauline Davidson, Ashley Dow, Alan Stephen Duffin, Lorraine Ann Duncan, Shona Lynn Ewan, Louise Findlay, Kelly Ann Gamak, Anne Fiona Golding, Leah Mary Gordon, Emma Hardingham, Amber Lanigan, Chloe Sarah Leslie, Karen Robertson Lowe, Lynn Shona Noble, Kim Joanne Purcell, Claire Louise Robertson, Jenna Claire Ross, Christine Jennifer Ann Ross, Kirsty May Smith, Emma Lynn Taylor, Leah Jane Williamson, Cheryl Amanda Wilson, Sharon Wilson, Terry Johanna Wiseman, Professional Development, Christopher Lee Bell, Nazia Bibi, Yasmin Kale, Lee Priestley, Amy Noreen Anglia Ross, Lauren Skelton, Kashif Zolfakar. Undergraduate Certificates, Teaching Qualification in Further Education. Tracy Marie Alexander, David Atkinson, Tracy Baxter, John William Beacon, Ross Orland, Elizabeth Jane Byrne, Jane Amanda Carrington, Gary Cochran, Samuel Crow, Alexander MacDonald Dixon, Paul Duffy, James Charles David Dunstan, Julia Eels, Stephen Campbell Elliott, John Robert Fitzpatrick, Sally Hamilton Gallagher, Sean Anthony Gallagher, Suzanne Galloway, Amanda Gibb, Angela Gibb, Gavin Tay Alfred Gilmore, K. 
Kim Helen Jessica Gilmore, Lucinda Helen Gorry, Stuart Bernard Harkins, Lisa Reed Hasty, Rory Macmillan, Baden Howarth, Ruth Mary Healy, Lisa Hendry, Angela Yvonne Herbertson, Stephen Sweet Fay Ho, Scott Irwin, Angela Joan Jack, Ryan Jenkins, Laura John, Stephen Stewart Johnston, Scott John Kennedy, Leanne Laird, Audrey McCauley, Caroline Louise McClement, Daniel McFadden, Callum Mackay, Lindsay Mackay, Gillian Louise McLeod, Henry McVeigh, Laura May, Stephen Martin, Alison Masterson, John Innes Meldrum, Catherine Sarah Mill, Louise Ann Moore, Sean Alexander Mossman, Mary Jane Murray, Fraser Nielsen, Melanie Madeline Newsom, Gillian Norrie, Heather Russell, Fiona Leslie Sanderson, Monmeet Sandhu, Rebecca Ann Scobie, Fiona Shelfer, Andrew Graham Sim, Sarah Jane Smith, Jacqueline Dawn Sopel, Amy Souter, Fabio Alfio Spina, Daniel Stevenson, Ross Watson Telfer, Nicola Third, Nicola Warburton, Dominic Jersey Wazalewski, Christopher Watson, Ian West, Neil White, Colin Wilson. Hi everyone, I just wanted to congratulate you all at the end of this extraordinary year and wish you all the very best in the future. We're all very proud of you in the School of Education and uh, it's been very challenging times. I think you'll all agree the words and standards flexible and adaptable you've experienced this year. So take that with you. Um, I want to wish you so much luck for the future. And you never know when we're out on the road again, visiting students in schools, we might uh, cross paths, which would be lovely when you have your own student. So celebrate and enjoy the summer and I wish you again all the very best. Congratulations everyone on graduating. I've worked with so many of you. It's so good to be part of your ceremony from my first ever BA Childhood Practice students graduating to my first big cohort of ME4s and finally to all the other master students who are graduating with me today. A big congratulations and I wish everyone all the best with their future careers. Hello, I'm happy to have this opportunity, even though it's just virtually, to say well done and congratulations. And that's from all your tutors on the MA programme. You've shown real determination and commitment and these are such important qualities in life and particularly in your chosen career. We wish you all the best as you go forward and we hope that you'll keep in touch with us and we want you to take care in these very challenging times and take some time to really enjoy this achievement. Well done, congratulations. Hello everybody. Um, firstly, congratulations on being awarded the MA degree from the University of Aberdeen. Uh, when you signed up to study as distance learners in an online environment, I don't think any of us had any conception of what an online environment was going to have and the significance that it was going to assume for us, especially over the past year. So. I'd like to congratulate you all on your resilience in continuing to work throughout everything that has happened during the pandemic. We all know how difficult it is to manage study, to manage employment, to manage your family 
and other things that um, are important to you as well. So um, well done uh, for all of that. We also remember that uh, when you first started studying on this degree, we showed you a video of John Carnahan um, talking to people about the fact that the most important four years in a child's life are up to the age of three. And we hope now that having completed your degree, you have a much more in-depth understanding of just what that remark um, actually contains. But it's not just how important it is um, for the child's life. We also are aware that if we're going to support children and particularly our most vulnerable children, then we need to have professionals with specialist expertise in that area. And I do feel that that is what you have now demonstrated. And I wish you well in your future career, wherever that is going to take you now. So finally, just on behalf of the whole teaching team, and I'll just remember everybody's names who've been involved with you over this time. So Brenda Dunn, Katrina Foy, Maria Gregorio, Sheila Nutkins, Yvonne Yule, and myself, Katrina McDonald. Once again, congratulations to all of you. Hello, class of 2021. I'm here with Starsky at King's College, and we've just come down to celebrate your graduation and say very well done and cheers. Oh, hello, Emmy for our graduates, should I say. Huge congratulations to you all on this most special of days. You've all worked so very hard and you should feel very proud of your achievements. The past 18 months in particular have been very difficult for you all, not least having to self-motivate during weeks of online studies, lectures, tutorials, and then having to navigate the path of procedures and expectations around teaching in schools during a pandemic, showing high levels of resilience and commitment while still smiling. So I really hope that wherever you are today, that the sun is shining and you have a wonderful time celebrating with friends and family. I wish you all the very best for your induction year. And before I go, I'm going to share this one-liner that was sent to me by one of last year's um, ME fours, who's now in our probationary year, having ticked the box. And she emailed in January to say, it's the middle of winter, it's pouring rain outside, we're in lockdown again, and I'm preparing to teach online for the first time ever. It's been an incredibly challenging but rewarding probation year so far, and I cannot believe that I'm nearly halfway through already. I was allocated a primary six class of 33 in a fantastic school, and I'm loving it. So I really hope that in the weeks, months, and years to come, that you're still loving it. So all the best, well done, congratulations, and stay in touch. My name is Dorothea Shira. I'm the Programme Director for the BA Childhood Practice and I would like to congratulate you on the completion of the BA Childhood Practice degree. Well done everyone. I know that it has been a really difficult year again with the pandemic and everything. I know that you have had to do extra work at your working place as well as on the childhood uh, degree so uh, fantastic you have completed it now well done and i wish you all the best for the future <laughs>